You won't believe how lucky one man got after a nail, a very large nail, went right through his eye. We have the pictures. And what your handshake may say about your risk for heart disease. CBS 2's Lisa Siegel is here now with today's Health Watch. It's interesting. Paul's hand. You are right there? Yeah. Okay, then I'll tell you what it means. Hi, you guys. Hello, everyone. But first, using a marijuana extract to help with symptoms of dementia may not be working like some experts had hoped. Research in the journal Neurology analyzed a group of patients who were given marijuana based pills for three weeks. Their findings showed no significant difference in dementia symptoms, including aggression, pacing, and wandering. Researchers say the drug appears to be safe, and testing should continue to see if different dosages just might make a difference. Well, do you have a strong grip? It seems doctors can learn a lot from the firmness of your handshake. A new study says the strength of a grip may be a better health marker than even blood pressure. Researchers followed 140,000 adults over four years. They found the weaker grip, the higher the chance of illness like heart failure or a stroke. And finally on Health Watch, meet a man from Boston who is so lucky. Look at these images from the New England Journal of Medicine. They tell the tale. A 27-year-old landscaper got a nail lodged in his eye while working. Now three surgeons worked together to get that nail out. All of this happening at Massachusetts General Hospital. Their skills really paid off. The nail is out and the landscaper has fully regained all of his vision, he did not have any permanent damage. Now, although the man has not been identified, we are told that nail was three inches long. Doctors say he was using a weed whacker that hit the nail, and that's when the nail flew right up into his eye. Those doctors, so good. Just one millimeter away from permanent damage. And wow. goggles for him next time. Absolutely. Yeah. Yep. Right. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs>